Aussie Heating, Air and Solar. Voted best heating and air company two years in a row. It's the second fire that we've seen mm -hmm. break out today. Yeah. A lot of people probably wondering, what are those winds like? What are the conditions out there? Well, the conditions right now are not good. When it comes to fires, we have dry. The atmosphere is very dry. We actually gonna, we're actually going to see the winds picking up out of the west. And then on top of that, it's hot. It made it to 100 degrees in Campo today. And we're expecting those temperatures to finally cool down a little bit tomorrow. But it's been a toasty day around the county. You can see Ocotillo made it to 119, 101 in Valley Center, and remote at 99, and also 99 in Alpine. So we had a pretty good chance of seeing triple digits all around. Thankfully, that wasn't the case. Only a few locations in Coronado. The skies are blue and it's looking gorgeous outside right now. And the conditions are going to be great to be at the beach once again. The water temperature, 71 degrees in average. Not bad at all. You can go in, enjoy the water. Just remember that we're going to see a lot more clouds heading into the weekend. But for now, it is still pretty warm out there. 72 degrees in San Diego. Dew points around 63. Winds coming out of the west northwest. And between now until at least... 10 o'clock tonight, the winds are still going to be a bit of a concern, so any fires in the area will definitely be a concern tonight. Temperatures will be cooling down 5 to 10 degrees tomorrow. We're going to see night and morning clouds and then a warm up in store for next week. Our heat advisory will be expiring tonight at 9 o'clock for the valleys and foothills and then over the deserts. Also expecting this heat excessive heat warning to expire at 9 o'clock. As we zoom out, just kind of looking at the big, big picture, high pressure set centered over the plains, bringing humidity mostly to the four corners, which is typical. That's the monsoonal flow, so it's not really tapping into our area. Instead, we're dry. There's a storm to the north and is going to bring a cool down in time for the weekend. We're going to see a lot more clouds traveling farther east tomorrow morning and even more so Friday night into Saturday. It could make it all the way back to the 15, reducing visibility early in the morning. Tonight, down to 63 in Ramona, 62 in Poway and 60 four degrees in San Diego. Campo will be down to 60, so thankfully it does cool down as we go into the overnight hours. Breaking it all down day by day in our 10 News Pinpoint 7 day forecast starting out the coast. Patchy fog early tomorrow. Temperatures around 74 with plenty of sunshine. Saturday and Sunday a bit more comfortable next week mid 70s with temperatures heating up almost like this week. Wednesday and Thursday will be the hottest days of the week. Inland communities will average around 87 degrees tomorrow, then back down to 84 and 82. So we have the weekend to enjoy, but get ready for another warm up next week. It'll be a gradual warm up starting Monday and Tuesday, and then by Wednesday and Thursday temperatures will peak. And over the deserts and mountains has been a very hot day today. Thankfully, tomorrow will be much better. Everybody's looking forward to that. Yes. Angelica, thank you.